Good morning, hello there, and welcome. Thank you for tuning in. This is Justin Mott, and now it's time for your local and area news. At Walking ISD, junior Connor Bragg has won state again in the long jump. This makes his second year in a row. I traveled to Walking yesterday and met with him. Uh, come from Walking, we really hadn't had just a whole lot of state champions come through our school, and me being one of them now is a pretty awesome feeling. Um, a lot of hard work has went into this, and me jumping, and I mean, I'm just really glad that it's paying off. And did you have any family members or coaches that inspired you to get in track? Um, when I was about eight years old, my mom and dad had considered track being a sport and me participating in it, so started young and just kind of saw success, and I kept at it, and man, here now is a pretty cool feeling. And lastly, you have any future college plans? Uh, I've gotten several offers in different places here locally and some far off, but I just really haven't committed anywhere yet. But I'm sure you will. Yes, sir. And moving along into sports news for baseball, the Shelbyville Dragons defeated the Cushing Bearcats 15-1. to And Game 2 will be tonight at Rusk High School at 5 p.m. Game 3 will follow if necessary. The Garrison Bulldogs will take on the Woden Eagles in a baseball game tonight at 5.30 p.m. in Hudson. Game 2 will be on Saturday at 1 p.m. also in Hudson. And Game 3 will follow if necessary. Moving along into some community news, the River City Festival is going on in Logansport, Louisiana. It continues today and tomorrow. Now the stage has been flooded next to the river, but they've set up other stages for the performers in the parking lot next to the police department in Logansport. And going on this Saturday, the Piney Woods Photographic Society will have their regular monthly meeting from 9 a.m. to 12 noon at the First United Methodist Church in Center. James Community Center will have their regular monthly meeting at the James Community Building at 6.30 p.m. this Saturday. The local VFW Post 8904 will have their post meeting on Monday, May the 20th at 6.30 p.m. at the Post Home, located at 617 Highway 96 North and Center. The Auxiliary, that's the Women's Auxiliary, will meet this Saturday, May the 18th at Las Margaritas Restaurant on the downtown Center City Square at 12 noon. Coming up, there's going to be a ribbon-cutting ceremony and grand opening for Terror Serenity Massage on Tuesday, May the 21st at 11 a.m. They're located at 111 Shelbyville Street. The Golden Harvest Ministries Club will host Center Mayor David Chadwick next Monday, May the 20th, at the Fellowship Hall of the Center First Baptist Church at 11.30 a.m. as he delivers the state of the city of Center. Hemphill High School with a blood drive in honor of Grace Hicks on Monday, May the 20th from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. And for more news, check out our website at cbc-radio.com. That's cbc-radio.com, keeping you connected wherever you go. You can also like and follow us on Facebook at Center Broadcasting Company on Facebook. With your news, this has been Justin Mott encouraging you to go out and be amazing. cbc-radio.com, keeping you connected wherever you go.